So I'm going to go through the right, left, and mid function because sometimes you get information in a spreadsheet. It's not easy easy to sum it up. Like for instance, if I want to sum these numbers up, it wouldn't work because the there are these stars in front, so nothing works if I summed it. And it could be all different things um, for whatever reason um, getting in the way of the numbers. So in this case, I could just use the right function equals right, and I see it's the last three digits I need. So write three. So whatever the last three things are in cell A1, it's going to provide me. And if it was more, you could do four or five. Um, and you could get you could get complicated, but once you know these functions really well, you can almost figure anything out. So if I just copy it down. So now you, you think you could summon all the numbers up right? But no, it doesn't work. Why? Because um, this is text. Because it doesn't know, because I'm just looking in the right three place values. It doesn't know that this is a number. It just looks like text. So in order to get it to, um, to be numbers so you can sum them or do whatever type of calculation you want, uh, there's different ways to do anything, but one way you can do equals value. And it'll look in this cell. And if, if there were letters in this cell, it, the value wouldn't make sense. It w there's no value with letters in it. But since there's only numbers in it, it's going to work. So if I copy down that formula, the value formula, now if I sum it, Now it works. So now I could sum it. And you could do this all inside one cell. You can put equals value and then nest the right function inside the value function. But I'm just doing this multiple steps so you can see. And the same idea with the left function. What if the stars were on the right side? So equals left, comma, three. Because I'm looking for the first three spots. And I'll just copy that down. And I can't sum it because it's text. So if I try to sum it, it won't work. So I'm going to do the value function equals value, look into that cell. And then I'll just copy that sum function over instead of manually typing it again. And now I could sum it. But what if the numbers were between the stars? Or it could be anything. I just put stars. But it could be like anything that are getting in the way of your numbers. You could use the mid function equals mid and I'm going to I'm going to look into this cell cuz you have to first select the cell you're using the mid function on and then you just have to type two numbers in. The first number is at what character you want to start at. So I could see this three stars and then my number 1. So the fourth character is the starting point. And how many characters do I want to, um, to give me? So I want three. So start with the fourth and give me three over. And you can play around with this function too. Like if you made an error and you put three by accident, you would just see it was star one zero. And then you would say, it. you obviously know that's not right. So you could do star, then you could do four comma three. And then copy that down. And like before, it's the sum won't work because it's text. 
So we'll use the value function to clean it up. Value. <clears throat> Now, if I copy the sum function, it gives me my uh, my sum of those numbers. So, so you could really manipulate data and get it to exactly how you want it if you know all these types of formulas. It takes a lot of time to learn them all, but I hope you learned something new today on the left, right, mid function. Please like the video, leave a comment. Thanks for watching.